like their wooden crates, their oil barrels, or their wooden barrels, uh, this product from Pegasus Hobbies, the Gothic Rubble set, comes in a clear plastic package. You can see what you're going to get. There's no surprises, uh, unlike a couple of the other items, which either had no false bottoms or they were pushed together in the packaging. So you get three pieces. If you've watched my other video on making rubble, I, I point out that the color is not too great on these. There's only really two shades. They could use a lighter highlight, in my opinion. And they could also use, then, some other coloration. And in here, there's actually some earth or soil. So you could go through and paint that um, brown and then maybe dry brush it to indicate dust. I do like the bottoms on these, which is, is an odd se selling point, uh, but uh, they're nice. They're uh, just, it, it feels very finished. Uh, unlike, you know, when I flip something I've made over. But a coat of paint could, could solve that. So they are really what you see is what you get. The little one is kind of eh. But the big one is, is nice. And then it kind of matches the, the archway, or it does match mm, slightly the the design uh, of the basic set. I, I need to go through and look through my other ones. When my wife saw this, she was like, oh, you, wow, I like that. Thinking that I had made it, and I pointed out that I hadn't. But uh, yeah, that this this section definitely adds a lot of interest to the piece, and then this one also has a little bit like that. So being able to see the actual pieces besides the little bricks is is something worth emulating. And then the actual bricks, if you have their sets, these are bricks in the background. And it's, they're not very noticeable. So whatever the, the person sculpting this drew, drew upon uh, had much more of a pattern, which you don't notice when you have the assembled buildings. At least not any of the ones I'm, I'm, I can think of. I've made a short video pretty long, so I, th I think that's about it. These are great in a pinch. Uh, you need some terrain. Stop by your hobby store. Pick some of these up. I got mine for $10.99. Uh, I don't know that I'll be buying any others myself. But for $10.99, uh, you do get exactly what you see. And uh, you have some difficult terrain to fight over.